Hey kids, have you ever wanted to read the book called The Hunger Games? Oh, you have? Okay, what about watch a movie based off of the book that already exists? Well, then why not go watch the live Broadway show at your nearest theater? Yes, you heard that right. Lionsgate announced today that it's partnering with Imagine Nation and Triangular Entertainment to bring The Hunger Games to the stage using, and I quote, innovative and immersive staging techniques. It will be launched in summer 2016 in a brand new purpose-built theater next to Wembley Stadium in London, UK. It will be produced by award-winning Broadway producer Robin DeLavita, UK promoter Harvey Goldsmith, Triangle Entertainment's Warren Adams and Brandon Victor Dixon of Walk Run Fly Productions, along with entertainment and executives Robert Harris and r, &R Media's Gary Ritchie. <sighs> Seriously? How much more can you do with the damn franchise? Am I supposed to be expecting to see Katniss Flakes at the grocery store soon? A Hunger Games anime show on Netflix? Honestly, seeing the popularity of the series, nothing would surprise me anymore. Sure, I enjoy the movies to some extent, but this is extremely unnecessary. Remember the Spider-Man musical that was announced a long time ago? My reaction to that was the exact same as my reaction to this. Stick with the movies. Just be a normal guy. Making a Broadway show into a movie is usually a good idea, but it doesn't work the other way around. And I quote, the theater is a fantastic medium to bring many meaningful layers of Suzanne Collins' writing to life, said DeLavita. That translates to, let me get my bullshit dictionary translator thingy out. <laughs> Here we go. Lionsgate wants to milk every cent out of the Hunger Games franchise, so they have asked me to help develop a pointless Broadway adaptation of the first movie in order to make more money. If this can become a show, then why isn't Uncharted the musical in development yet? I would sell a kidney to watch that. All jokes aside, it seems like it's becoming a trend to burn franchises to the ground these days, whether it be in gaming or movies. <sighs> Five different versions of the same game being sold, <coughs> Street Fighter 4, or making a sequel for a movie that nobody asked for, <coughs> Cars 2 and 3. Honorable shout out to the new Scream series that is being developed for MTV. How do you even make such a straightforward movie into a freaking TV show? This needs to stop immediately before every form of media ends up being recycling things or ends up recycling things of past stuff or bringing one media into another, in this case, being a book into a movie into a Broadway show. Lord help us all. Y'all are just falling for this stuff over and over again. The movie of a book comes out, you immediately go watch it. A Broadway show comes out, you immediately go watch it. You don't realize all these companies and whatever are making love to you, making nasty love to you in your butthole, and you just take it like a champ. You're not supposed to take it like a champ. You're supposed to say no. It's okay to say no. My God. I'll leave a link to the article in the description. Now that I found my temporary outro quote, I'll leave this video with a yeet.